Everyone likes a good haircut and we'd like to know what a barber does on a day-to-day -day basis. We've all had our hair done by professionals before, but do we really know the people that do it? Well, what we do know is that we trust them and we seem to stick with the same ones for a very long time. So how long have you known your barber for? A year. Over 10 years. Three years? About six years. Six years. What do you think a haircut to an individual means? It's like I feel cleaner. I feel like neater and just smarter and just ready. Like just, you know, the reason I get a haircut is just because I feel a bit grubby and a bit homeless looking. Yeah, I'm really weird. Like, I love my haircut and the day after, I don't like it. I cry a bit. And then, <laughs> <laughs> and then I get over it and I'm like, yeah. <laughs> Always crying to get my haircut. And then, um, a bit weird. Uh, and then I'm like, you know what, it's cut now, what am I going to do about it? And then I embrace it and it's fine. I feel like if I'm going out that like, night or something and yeah. I have my hair cut, my hair looks nice, I'm like, well, there's one thing I don't have to worry about and it just like, you know, could give me a bit of confidence. Yeah, it's definitely it's like a mini confidence boost. Our documentary will be set in London in three very different locations. The environments we'll be exploring will give us an insight into three very different cultures. London's the most diverse city in the world. So it only makes sense to take a look at the different barbershops, culturally and socially. By having these three barbershops, we can show our audience how a barbershop can reflect the identity of an area. As we're students, our equipment will be provided for us. However, your funding would go towards logistics, marketing and promotion, catering, casting file narrator and domain hosting. We are aiming to enter our documentary to the youth festival held at our university. If you were to win, this would be the springboard into other festivals such as the Southampton Film Festival and the Winchester Film Festivals. This would hopefully get our names out there. So please donate and join us on this wonderful and crazy adventure. We promise to give you the best documentary you can possibly produce. If you want any more information, take a look at the links below. Thank you for listening.